I'm Dora Michelle and this is Makeup or Breakup Vlog and today I'm going to be doing a quick look with the e.l.f. Bite Size <laughs> eyeshadows and this is one this one is in the shade cream and sugar can we okay so I'm going in there is fallout there is some fallout I'm going in with the first color here As the base all right I'm using a kind of like a firm kind of brush to pack that on this is a lovely day to evening kind of thing I'm gonna use this color here at the far end this beautiful rich chocolate as my crease just to get that ball rolling, doing a sweeping motion back and forth. Pigmentation's there, folks. <laughs> Pigmentation is definitely there. And I'm going to go in with an even fluffier brush and just soften those lines between the chocolate brown and the rest of the look. There we go. Excuse the weird looks on my face. I just try to make that go like that. And I'm thinking for here, I want to go in one of these two. It's like a golden and like a creamy shimmer. So I'm going to go with the golden first. And I'm going to apply that on the outside like so. Oh, look at that. Oh, how pretty is that? And again, this is for like up to the middle of the lid wow that is nice I'm gonna forgive my weird face and then for the inner corner I'm gonna use this bad boy so I'm wondering I'm gonna try to use like a little brush first to see if I can apply it that way something that could pack it in Oh yeah. This shimmer does pack a punch. I was not because normally I have issues with 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 powders with shimmers. I mean that they don't come off the palette really well. Here you can, wow, okay, okay. I'm kind of shocked. And this is a $3 palette. This is what blows my mind. $3, folks. Well, I can't get over the color payoff and that the shimmers come off with a brush and they cling and they work. This is amazing. Oh, that just like perks up the eyes right there. <sighs> Let me just try out these four colors so you can see. One, that's a um, matte. And this is the, the highlight I put in the center of my eyes. This is the one I put on the mid to outer of the lid and this is what I use for definition which I may go back in and define some more I'm not sure there's the four they one two three four now these have a chunky consistency they do might don't mind my bruise there but 
the first one, which is the base. So clearly it disappears into my skin. The second one is that in shimmer that you see here, incredible. The third, which is this brown, sorry for the noise outside, is what I put, I put this in the outer, like from midpoint to here. So you could see that shimmer right there. And then this fourth one was in the crease. And I still haven't done the top of my eye by the brow bone yet, but you see the differentiation of the color, the blendability, $3, this is great. I think I'm gonna go in and smoke the bottom with this color because this, this chocolate is to die for. So I'm just gonna go underneath real quick and connect these bad boys. Wow, that's all I gotta say on this stuff. It's amazing. Go back in there, make it a little more dramatic. a fluffy brush to and I guess I'm thinking I could go in with this color and just use that to tone it down a bit let's see oh yeah that works oh yeah so bite-sized eyeshadow and cream and sugar, I'd say not bad for $3. Okay guys, so this is my completed look. What do you think? I am loving, I, I'm, I'm, $3, seriously? Seriously, Elf? Gorgeous, just. I'm going through uh, each one as I find them and pick them up. And so far, this one tends to be real. I mean, look at the color payoff. They have an avocado uh, tinged one, a green one. I'm dying to get a hold of. Um, but I have to say, overall, this particular one, I enjoyed tremendously. Look at the color payoff. I mean, just look at it. I'm amazed. <laughs> And definitely if I wanted to go more smoky for night, I would obviously add more of this and maybe charge it up a bit more with that and just keep it moving. But I have to say, hmm, I feel like calling this sugar and spice, but this is called cream and sugar. So I said, if you haven't picked up one of these guys, I think you definitely should, it's $3. And if you're unsure and don't wanna try a crazy color, you may wanna try with something a little you know, every day that you could wear. This is outrageous. $3 is outrageous. So what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, hit that like button and even better, hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you will know my next video will be up. I'm so blown away by this, this is awesome. Thank you so much for joining me on my latest makeup adventure. Have you tried the e.l.f. Bite Me or Bite Size? As I said, Bite Me, Bite Size eyeshadows let me know in the comments below and so if you haven't already hit that like button and even better hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you will know my next video will be up thank you so much for joining me on my latest makeup adventure and taking time out of your day to view and i will see you on the next makeup adventure don't forget to click subscribe and the notification bell bye